Hi everyone, Mike from CCTV Camera Pros here. I recently upgraded my home security camera system to an IP system using all Vutron IP cameras and a Vutron NVR. Uh, I installed uh, two AI cameras to cover my front yard. Uh, one is that one behind me that covers this front area of my front yard. And I have a second one over here on the other side of my driveway installed here over in the corner of my house that basically covers my whole driveway. What I'm gonna do in this video is I'm gonna show you how I can configure uh, the AI people detection, uh, human detection on the NVR so that if someone comes into my yard, uh, let's say late at night, like maybe uh, after 10 o'clock at night up until like uh, uh, five in the morning, if anyone's in my front yard, I wanna make sure that that book, that event is bookmarked on the NVR and that I know about it. Uh, you can also trigger alarms like push notifications uh, to the mobile app and even email alerts uh, using this functionality. So uh, I'm gonna walk you through how to set this all up. I'm controlling the interface on the NVR now and the first thing I'm gonna do is select settings from the menu. On the main settings screen, under the AI event section, I'm going to select People Perimeter Detection. And then on this screen, I'm going to select the camera that's covering my driveway, and then select Detection, and then Intrusion. I check this Enable Detection by IPC box to enable this type of artificial intelligence setting for this particular camera. Next, I'm going to draw a perimeter around the area where I want the intrusion to be detected. So basically my driveway. If anyone enters my driveway, uh, I want them to be detected. So I'll basically just draw a shape around my driveway. And then uh, for the detection target, I'm gonna select people so that only uh, people are detected. I don't need to detect uh, vehicles. Next, I click on this trigger mode tab and then what I wanna do is select snapshot. That's gonna create like a bookmarked event on the NVR so that I can easily go back and see what happened when these events are triggered. Now, if I wanted to, I could also select push uh, here if I wanted to get a push notification on my phone. Uh, this is very easy to set up too, but I'm gonna go over this in more detail in another video. So for now, just realize that when you trigger an event using these AI functions, in addition to recording, you can trigger other things like uh, a push notification, an email alert, uh, even triggering an external alarm uh, can be done. Uh, so next, I'm gonna go through the same process for the other camera in my front yard. So that one camera covers my driveway and this second AI security camera uh, covers, covers the rest of my front yard uh, to the right of the driveway. So I'm gonna go through the same process here and select intrusion and enable that type of detection. And then same thing, I'm gonna draw a perimeter around the area where I want people detected. And the uh, detection target again is just people and I'm gonna click apply there. And once again, go into trigger mode and select snapshot. Uh, and again, I won't do push notifications in this video, but just know that, that that's very easy to set up as well. So after I click apply, all those settings are in place and then I'll exit back out to the live view on the NVR. The next thing I wanna do is test out the people detection function that we just set up. So I'm gonna to switch to the uh, single camera view for my driveway camera. And uh, on this screen, I'm gonna right click and then select target detection. Uh, what this target detection function does is it enables visualization uh, on the AI software on the NVR. So uh, you'll notice that when I enabled that, uh, a little window on the right opened up, uh, and, and that's going to be real-time detection of uh, AI events that occur. And then you'll notice on the main screen, you can see the perimeter that I drew around the driveway uh, that notates the detection area. And you can actually see the software is also detecting my car, although... Uh, we're just doing people detection for the alarm. The visualization will show you all of the different types of objects that the software is detecting. So in a second, you're gonna see me approaching the view from the right-hand side of the screen. Here I come uh, up the sidewalk, 
and uh, you can see the software is already tracking me as a person with that yellow box that's around me. And then when I cross the threshold of the intrusion detection area, uh, you can see that that event is bookmarked uh, in, on the visualization, the real-time visualization on the right. And you see the software continues to track me as an object, whether I'm inside the detection zone or not. Uh, that's what this visualization is doing. And I really just wanted to test right there to make sure the alarm was being properly triggered. Now that we confirm that the AI software is working correctly and that intrusion detection zone is working correctly on my driveway, I want to set up the recording on the NVR. To do this, I select settings from the main menu and then record. On the recording screen, notice that I have the mode set up to customization. This, this gives you more flexibility of the different recording types and schedules that you can set up on these Vutron NVRs. Under the AI record schedule, I'm going to set my driveway camera and my walkway camera to the nighttime schedule and then hit apply. So I'll go into the schedule management screen here for a second and just show you um, how I set up this nighttime schedule. This is basically a custom schedule I set up um, that runs between about 10 p.m. Uh, or about 9 p.m. actually and uh, uh, about 5.30 in the morning. And then back on the recording screen, notice that under time record schedule for all the security cameras on my system, I do have them recording around the clock uh, 24, you know, 24 hours a day. So the NVR is recording all cameras 24 hours a day, but in addition, it'll bookmark any uh, intrusion events on those two cameras on my front yard anytime in intrusion occurs during the night schedule. I hope this video was helpful. If you want to learn more about these Vutron security camera systems and some of the other AI functions that are supported, please visit www.cctvcamerapros.com slash AI. Thank you for watching.